Hello and thanks for tuning in to Bloomington Today. Let's take a look at what's buzzing in Bloomington. Europolis is back with a fresh new look. The Greek restaurant has been in Bloomington since 2005 and after several months of renovations, they've reopened nearly tripling in size. The city of Bloomington partnered with Europolis to help coordinate the project. Staff worked to help put together the tax increment funding district that helped make the project possible and assisted in acquiring grant funds from the Minnesota Department of Employment and Economic Development to assist with the demo of the old gas station at 90th and Penn. This project is one example of what the city can do for local businesses when using tools available to promote equitable economic growth. Recently, the city hosted two events for the public to take a look at concepts that show what's possible for trails, natural resource restoration, and improvements at Moyer Park as part of the Nine Mile Creek Corridor Renewal Project. The technical work by the consulting team reflects data collected over the summer and feedback from community members at a number of different engagement opportunities, both in person and online. One of the results shows that a shared use walking and biking trail is not feasible. An ADA accessible pedestrian and bike connection to the Minnesota River may be possible at Queen Avenue. We continue to check in with the public on what we're putting on paper and share our understanding with the community about what we're building and continue to seek feedback. Staff and our team feel really grateful for the engagement of our community in helping us get to this point in the project. Visit the city's Let's Talk Bloomington page by November 15th to review concepts, complete a short survey, and provide feedback. That's a wrap on this week's Buzz. If you would like to watch other stories from the show, highlighting people, places, and projects in Bloomington, visit the city's YouTube channel. Thanks so much for watching.